Hello guys, so basically here I have a E90 uh, 320 diesel uh, with the N47 engine, 177 brake horsepower. Uh, I've noticed that when I do a uh, diagnostics on the car, I'm having a fault in the DDE. Um, looking at the fault, it's coming up as, uh, so glow plug cylinder one activation. Now, I've replaced the glow plug in cylinder one, and I'm st still getting this error code. So, I I'm putting it down to that we've got an, a faulty glow plug control unit. Uh, so, in this video, I'm going to show you today how to change this module. Okay, so basically, I've removed the engine cover. Uh, just undone this hose here moved it out the way and you can actually see right down here is the glow plug control unit so we're going to loosen those two i believe 10 mils and we're going to move that bracket out the way uh, and try and get to it like that so uh, i managed to get the the bracket off uh, that plug there was a bit difficult to get out as it's as you can probably see here uh, there's not much wiring on the plug so you couldn't really pull it out so it stops about there so that's basically the first um, the first wire you need to remove. And once you get that wire removed, that plug, you can then bring the actual um, control unit up to about this height, which that one there is a lot more accessible. Uh, so now I'm just going to remove it from the bracket, swap the new one over to this bracket here, and then plug it all back in again. And hopefully that should work. Okay, so now that the control unit is bolted back in um, and connected, I'm just going to do another diagnostics on it and see if it's uh, cured, if it's fixed that issue. So if we just go into scan, that's the issue that we had and there's no faults. Fantastic. I have just did it beforehand. I, I, I should have should have filmed it. Um, but uh, it, it came up with a load of faults uh, as I disconnected the module without uh, disconnecting the, the battery positive uh, negative cable. It's probably what I should have done first, really. Uh, so if you do do this, uh, uh, yeah, disconnect the battery first. Um, sorry, I should have mentioned that first. Obviously, I didn't do that. Uh, but as you can see, there are no codes in the DDE, which is good. Um, and now, obviously, well, I've been told uh, if you have any issues with glow plugs or control units in the DDE, that will stop your car from doing a DPF regeneration, which uh, in, t in time, sorry, you will have a DPF light appear on your dashboard as your car's not doing a regen. So I would strongly advise that if you have any issues in that uh, circuit in the engine DDE, um get it seen to as soon as otherwise it will just give you other problems so uh yeah thanks for watching my video uh i hope i've uh i've helped anybody out with replacing that module it didn't take me that much time it was really fairly simple um so uh i'd, I'd definitely recommend anyone to give it a go to be honest rather than pay extortionate dealer prices so uh so yeah great stuff thank you very much bye